Sometimes when you're on the set and it's a very physical role, you have to do whatever works for you. You have to find a little private alcove, such as, you know, this here, and just uh, practice your stuff. Since I'm going to be shooting this film, I've kind of worked out and beefed up a little bit. Because I have to play this ultimate soldier. When I was a machine, I yearned to be a man. Now I'm better than both. Ah! I never really want to do the same exact routine because you always train your body to adapt. I can't just adhere to a fitness and bodybuilder type workout because I'm doing physical action. If I were to just do that, I would cramp up. You know, I go down to very low body fat, but then I throw a punch and I would just wince in pain. Up to two weeks beforehand, I will work out about four hours a day. I may go through speed kicking drills. And hand techniques also. I do that and I do something called katas. Formalized martial arts movements. And I do katas in several disciplines. You know, when you're practicing martial arts, you're, you're practicing to, like, kick someone's head off of their body. A kick like this could tear someone's head off. And this is when you're trying to get very close. If I'm doing this, I have 220-some pounds whipping, whipping. You have to be able to know your range and cheat the movement. An accident like that is really, you know, that's a serious accident. That's one that, that makes headlines. need to call on energy throughout the day. And that's when nutrition comes in. I'm drinking three gallons of water a day, distilled water. My diet is consisted of 70% protein. Protein is all food that had parents. Things that are very salt-free, very sugar-free, and very taste-free. And that basically, you know, makes me fat-free, but very ornery. Ah! Wrap time, I'm eating three pizzas. Well, four pizzas. What the hell? I'll do physical training, like, like gym training, where I'll do like a whole upper body circuit, and then the next day, I'll do a lower body circuit. I do basic curls, but I only go, on a situation like this, I go lightweight, high reps. You don't wanna just get a whole bunch of bulk. It makes it harder for you to control yourself. And I want to keep myself nice and loose so I don't sacrifice speed. Because, you know, the camera will see that. And so would the opponent. And so would you. Um, that's the uh, makeshift on-set workout, basically. I gotta get to set. <laughs> right, they call me? Tune in next week when we'll have uh, working out at craft service. Dangerous.